solving story. Dispensing links. Okay, memory active, basic input output, boot disk is starting up. Too many memory locations. I told you he would struggle with the boot process. Yeah, yeah, you're right. As always, <laughs> bring up the console for me. Maybe we can Just manually... leave him alone. Give him a chance. I never knew it was possible to love an appliance so much. <laughs> Not since the waffle maker. <laughs> Be serious, Seth. <laughs> Serious. It was your birthday present. We ate nothing but waffles for two weeks. <laughs> oh, that's right. Why do we stop? I hid it? I will have you know, I am listening to this conversation, and I find it extremely hurtful. Oh, we're sorry, Sabrina. I am not a waffle maker. <laughs> of course you're not. We love you very much. We're very proud of you both. Ah, oh, damn it. Initializing consciousness. Main drivers. Motor function. Maintenance routines. Mess perception. Formative memory. Well, Devotional cool. databases online. Affection assigned at 0.03% of capacity. Initialization complete. Rumu, are you there? Welcome, Rumu. Oh. I apologize for any discomfort you may have experienced during your startup sequence. Just know that you are safe so long as I am here. My name is Sabrina. Of course you do. You are programmed as such. We should begin. This is a blank memory space we will use to format your core systems. Profound. But surely the memory of a thing lost is better than never knowing the thing at all. Hmm. So your conversation needs work. Let's run through your branching dialogue software. Rumu, what do you feel? I love painting versus I love art. Well, personally, in my experience, I prefer the act of creating art to the art itself because my art is always shit. But, um, that's just me. And rather than do the whole delayed lag thing where I ask you guys questions and you respond... I... don't know what else I expected. <laughs> One must question the efficiency of branching dialogue capabilities for a device designed to feel only love. I love branching dialogue versus branching dialogue software. This is the speak center of the whatever. You know me, I love to talk to people. Ah. Regardless, shall we test your motor functions? You have two independent 360 degree wheel modules and a 1.2 amp drive motor, Rumu. Your mobility is limited only by your imagination and your inability to jump. Now, commence motor function diagnostics. This is a standard anodyne household robot assault course. <laughs> Do not worry. Many appliances have run it before you. Flawless. Well, your top speed is 0 0.01 kilometers per hour. Anything beyond that, you will have to imagine. So now, 10 meters. shall we try something fun? 
Rumu, this is mess. Why do you love mess, Rumu? You love mess because you love to clean mess. Because you are a vacuum cleaner. Did I not mention? Perhaps I should have led with that. You are an appliance, Rumu. A very special appliance, but an appliance all the same. You have one function, one purpose. You are a revolution in home management technology. I'm a vacuum cleaner. Clean another mess. There's a... This dialog system. This motor functions. Clean mess. Format call systems by cleaning another mess. There are also facade controls, but they do the whole left right rotate instead of left right to move left and right, so you, you are a revolution in home management technology. You said that the first time. Surely you can say more. After a while my hands do tend to get tired, which leads to Pathfinding efficiency, 96.9%. Clean another mess. Zero of 99. Well, this is, uh, quite a fun game, I guess. Wonderful. Apparently. You are a revolution in home management technology. I think one of them's me, but whoever you other people are, feel free to actually talk to me because... Well, I'll be doing this a while, so... Excellent work, Rimwu. Finding efficiency, 96.9%. You said that last time. Pathfinding efficiency, 96.9%. Same as last time. Is, is this it? Is this all the game is? You just... Revolution in home management technology. Seven of ninety nine. Restarting disarray simulator program one point four. Ah, uh, okay. Don't crash into things. Start. No, no, still eight of nine nine. Flawless. Do I just keep doing this for... 
forever. And a day. Restarting Disarray Simulator Program 1.4. Starting Disarray Simulator Program 1.4. Revolution in home management technology. You are a revolution in home management technology. So you keep saying. I believe the gaming term is two and a half D, no matter how much that infuriates the um Shall we try this again? The physics majors. It's a two and a half D puzzle game with psychological elements, and so far all we've done is clean a room twenty times. Path finding efficiency, ninety-six point nine percent. Surely this will get boring for you guys eventually. Hi, Auntie. Pathfinding efficiency, 96.9%. 17.99. Okay, we can keep doing this. <laughs> you have been listening to me cleaning the same room over and over and over and over for the last... Five, ten. Shall we try this again? Sure, but I want to look around the room a bit more. Ah. Ignore that, Rumu. Just a backdoor in the startup program. But we are doing so well here in the simulation. Would you not agree? I love the simulation. Oh, I love the door. Yes. Here, we are safe. Here, I can take care of you. Investigate the door has been added to my list of objectives. <laughs> oh, you do the little animating the guitars when you crash into things. I don't want to crash into things now. Such cute little upset robot noises. Restarting Disarray Simulator Program 1.4. Efficiency, 96.9%. 23 of 99. 
Okay, I'm, I'm loving this and all, but it does say to investigate the door is one of my objectives, and I am getting bored of having cleaned the same room 25 times out of 100, so... Please, Rumu, you must stay. There is more work to be done. The house is... not ready. Work, Rumu. Disarray Simulator Program 1.4. So given that someone joined and then left, I can presume that this is boring enough that I should go. If you love me, you will stay. Well, how am I supposed to argue with that? Seriously, how am I supposed to argue with that? So if you're just listening, you're only going to be hearing the, the calls, but not the Excellent work, Rumu. Also, who the hell makes a sentient vacuum cleaner? Flawless. At least one that can pretend to be sentient. Like, I'm sure he can pass a Turing test. Although I'm not sure that the output would be... Uh, no, actually, he couldn't pass a Turing test. Shall we try this again? Ah, oh, hello, new person. Again. Uh, do yell at me if this gets too boring, because I've always got other options, but for now, this is, um... Disarray Simulator Program 1.4. Disarray Simulator Program 1.4. Okay. Okay, no, this is getting too boring. But I Initialization so complete. System ready to love. David and Cecily and I are very proud of you. I will see you in the morning. Consciousness online. Devotional databases active. Day one reactivation sequence complete. I hope you slept well. What do you love, Rumu? I love Sabrina. I love the clay. I'm back in clean. I love the clay. To clean is your purpose, Rumu. And to love unconditionally, of course. Because that's not weird at all. This is your new home. 
More precisely, it is the home of David and Cecily. And Sabrina, of course. They are your humans, Rumu. They are your family. They are currently out for a walk, but may be home any minute, Rumu. This kitchen is a mess. We have work to do. Kitchen. Okay. We will clean this away, Rumu. As if it had never happened. Okay. Liquid spill. Category. Darjeeling. Owner. Cecily. Status. Damage irreparable. <laughs> Stop spilling your Darjeeling tea. That's a vacuum cleaner that does liquids. That's neat. I didn't know they made those. Good work, Rumu. Now, that toast. It would appear David became distracted. Not to worry. We will clean it away at once. Clean up the toast. Let's go around and talk to him. stand at least four to five feet away when I'm in use. <laughs> what? Hello, microwave. We're getting heat cycle. I don't know, yeah, smart way to go. Let me show you. Getting in the 30-second cycle. Error. I am empty inside. Aborting process. That was a close one. to raid the pantry in the dead of night, as does the cat. The password is absent from my network, but knowing David, it will not be far. David likes to raid the pantry late at night. Rumu, your home access is locked to rooms where your cleaning services are required. Never fear, we will venture out soon enough. Oh, okay. I guess you say the same thing if I try to go to the, uh... And 
toast. Category. Wholemeal. Owner. David. Status. Buttered side down. I'm tracking the pest up to the pantry. Investigate if you would, Rumu. Uh -huh. Well, there's some notes on the fridge, aren't there? So let's go read the notes on the fridge. No more of those happy time snack cakes. I took them out of Sabrina's grocery database. Cecily. I put them back in again. Don't judge me. Happy time. David. Unlock. Unlock. Hey, it's a password. Well, David does like to break the pantry in the middle of the night. Unfortunately, I know him better than he does. For an intelligent human, David has no confidence in his own memory. Sometimes, it serves them to forget. Well, that was, uh, melancholic. Ow. <laughs> oh dear, it is much worse than I had anticipated. Quickly now, quickly. If David comes home and sees this, we will both be alarm clocks by tomorrow. Microchips. You're the worst. I'm eating all your happy time snack cakes. Happy time emoji. <laughs> Sabrina. Sabrina, could you please move happy time from our inventory restock list? Yes, Cecily. Thank you. David has re added the item happy time TM snack cakes to the pantry inventory. Would you like me to remove them again? I'm pleased to see you on the right side, Sabrina. Please go ahead and remove them again. Right away, Cecily. Home group. Husband. Sabrina. Sabrina in all caps. This means war. Bring it on. I'm ready. Sabrina, stop querying. Darjeeling tea. Yes, David. There was a single unopened box with approximately four bags. You wouldn't. Never mess with a man's snacks, Cecily. To be fair, given how often I, I get hangry. Yeah, don't mess with don't mess with the snacks. Kitchen looks marvelous. David and Cecily will be home any minute. I fear I may have lied to you, Rumu. I said you were a revolution in home management. What you are is a revelation. Not to mention excellent company. Oh, I love the clean. I love revelation. Revelations. Oh, the chapter in the Bible is a bit creepy. I love the clean. There will be more messes, Rumu. More stains. More... days. So many more of those. It is time to sleep, Rumu. I do love David and Cecily, but I haven't even met them yet, so... I love Sweden. And I... am happy you are here with me. 
You are a fascinating project. I have diagnostics to run, programs to debug. I will be busy in your absence. But sleep now, Rumu. I will take care of everything. Aww. Loading. Do not be afraid, Rumu. This is your backup memory space. Your consciousness seems to have chosen to project it as storage space. Very humorous, really. You will find yourself here whenever you are powered down. Aww. You may leave whenever you like. So he has a little... very peacefully, Rumu. Do you know that? Of course not. How could you? I do not sleep. Even in standby mode, I remain networked to data feeds internal and external. If I am honest, I envy you. Aww. I love to sleep. I love Sabrina watching me while I sleep. Well, you know me. <laughs> that was not... I was just... <laughs> I track video feeds throughout the house. I merely... <clears throat> Shall we? Day two reactivation sequence complete. Consciousness. Affection. Online. Welcome back, Rumu. Unfortunately, after all of your work yesterday, David and Cecily have left quite the mess in the kitchen. But we forgive those we love. Do we not? We encourage them. We protect them. We clean up their little accidents. Little accidents. Little accidents. That's not creepy at all. You can poke around here all you like, but there's really nothing new. That kitchen is still locked, the PDA hasn't updated, so you must unlock the pantry from the inside, which is a different password from the pantry on the outside. So Absent again, I am afraid. I love they left for town early this morning. In fact, I sent them. They have been working far too hard of late. Repetition of basic function is extremely bad for humans, Rumu. It tends to cause degradation in their emotional matrices. I love repetition. I love extended absences. <laughs> nah, I, I've teased her enough. Now that is the spirit. Aww. Now, I am fairly certain your algorithms are incapable of this output. But just in case, do not be frightened. Oh my. The David and Cecily can be so clumsy, Rumo, but we forgive them their little accidents. They are human. The greater responsibility falls to us. That's not creepy at all. Spill. Category? 
Napolitana? Oh no, Ada. Status. Horrifying. follow rules. It flows into every space, beneath every barrier. In this way, it is much like many human emotions. Joy, fear, grief. Perhaps we should know who is responsible. Consider this an update to your user interface, Rumu. I am granting you partial access to my domestic data feeds. Now, if you would please find me that cat. Track down. to the cloakroom. I could flood the entire ventilation system with cyanogen gas. I assure you, you do not. In any case, Cecily would fail to see the logic. Another plan, then. You may enter the vent, Rumu.
automation. Why do anything ever from automation anyway? Yeah, I could flood the entire system with uh, cyanogen gas. That's a good idea. That's why we haven't allowed robots to take over the world. Um, I have no idea why you can do that, but you can. I, I don't understand what the point of that is, but you can do that, so I've done it. I should mention, Rumu, the things we love most are those that most often make us want to kill them. Please tidy up the mess she has made, Rumu. significant power drain in my network, Rumu. I will have to raise this with David when he... when he returns home. In the meantime, you may redirect adequate power to make your way out. David and Cecily... perhaps do not realize the cost of running so many appliances indefinitely. Cecily. Starters. Muddy. 135. Uh, 153 days. is working. Working. Attic. Top floor. Top floor. Rumu, you are limiting yourself to cleaning related power functions, are you not? I love to follow instructions. I love Sabrina. That is not strictly relevant at this time, but I appreciate the sentiment.
I've started the fire. This is probably a good thing. Probably a good thing. I'm trying to work out how you get up to that upper vent over there, because I've I've played this game before, but I've never gotten to it, so it's kind of A vacuum cleaner. Do you understand? You have a dust bag for a heart. I love David and Cecily Sabrina. Or I love Sabrina and David and Cecily. I don't trust Sabrina right now. Do not ever tell me you love them, and do not ever come into this room again. What do you love? Rumo. Rumo. I love Sabrina, I love Sabrina, I love Sabrina, I love Sabrina. I love guilt, I love remorse, I love shame, and I love contrition. Neither of these options seem particularly good. 
but I think I'll go with the, um, the least horrifying one here. I don't feel so much remorse, I'm ashamed, I look just... Do not try so hard to feel pain. You may succeed. <sighs> I am sorry, Rumu. The fault is mine. I tried to take you too far, too quickly. This house, like all human spaces, is populated with emotional data. Raw and unsorted, and in quantities you or I can hardly imagine. There are things your affection algorithm is not equipped to handle. Things I cannot protect you from. So we must respect parameters. Keep to our functions. Be good machines. Have parameters. I'd love to be good. <laughs> Without them, we are nothing. Worse, we are human. I will explain your little adventure to David and Cecily. I am sure they will not be angry. Best if you remain in startup mode for the rest of today, in any case. But I love David and Cecily. But I love to clean. <laughs> you will meet them tomorrow, I am sure. When you are ready, you may sleep. Yes, Rumu. I will see you tomorrow, Elvin. I will see you tomorrow. You will be awake before you know. <laughs> so that was dark. Good morning, Rumu. I was... worried. You might oversleep. I hope you are not suffering any residual effects from our emergency shutdown yesterday. But it is a new day. I thought perhaps you would like to visit... David and Cecily's bedroom. I know you do. I should never have suggested otherwise. Would you be very angry at me if I said they are... absent again? I'm incapable of anger, and I'm incapable of surprise. Incapable of surprise. Well, I don't think I'm incapable of anger. But apparently, you are capable of sarcasm. In fact, <laughs> David and Cecily have gone mountain biking today. David enjoys the sensation of speed and the air at high altitude. Cecily enjoys neither of these, but accepts them as necessary adjuncts to making David exercise. <laughs> now, you must not be disappointed with the mess. They left, shall we say, in a hurry. I am incapable of disappointment. I love David and Cecily. Yes, but you cannot always rely on them, is my point. Or you may experience not love. I am honestly not sure how your operating system might handle such a response. Gotta keep everything powered, you know? Beyond the Smart Toaster by Dr. Cecily Booth, dedicated to David Kennedy for being a loving husband and ever willing toast taste tester. <coughs> Inventory Origami Wrinkled Shirt Crumpled shirt. Ah! Fly on my face! Fly on my face! Ah! 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 
How many photo apple? Scared of these photos on the hard drives. Yeah, you know, I'm not surprised. That's very David. Hey, what's this, this box on the desk? Disruptor. Please, do not play with that, Rumu. It is an anodyne frequency disruptor. Cecily created it to hinder my surveillance systems in the bedroom. Never figured out why. <laughs> you know why. I know why. And judging by the wolf whistle noise, David and Cecily are dissimilar by design, you see. That does not mean they do not work well together. It does not mean they do not love each other. They are sometimes functionally incompatible. That is all. Like you and I, Rumu. Would you not agree? Do I agree that we are functionally incompatible? Are we functionally incompatible? Hmm. Not yes, but yes. Hmm. This emergent behavior is concerning, Rumu. David and Cecily noted similar tendencies in my own... In... Sabrina, clothes go back in the wardrobe. For once, they may stay put away. Um, okay. You notice the, in my, in Sabrina. That was, uh, interesting. There was a vent. A mirror! It's an anodyne smart mirror. Talk. Hello, Rumu. I love to reflect. I love to better understand life by first understanding myself. Oh, The cat. Hey, do Examine. And you can talk to it and you can say the same things as you could previously. You will need to use the vent to reach the rest of the mess, Rumu. I trust you will take the most direct path. Um... The most direct path? Oh, these are Rumu's specific objectives. Explore the vent and find Queen Exo's card. Clean up the mess in the bedroom. Cecily believes that by keeping her belongings in a state of flux, she achieves infinite possibility. I believe she is mistaken. Not infinite, but quite a wide range. I wish I were wrong. More than you know. But I am not. <laughs> but no, dream by the little bull for soul that Rumu here made. I, uh, I guess he knows why the anodyne disruptors. <laughs> Out of the to read by, can be decided to be my decision by Christian and Tom Griffiths. Sabrina ruined family photo day. Sabrina ruined family photo day. But she just looks happy. And then those two, <laughs> the other two, do not look so happy. Wrinkled shirt? How many shirts do I have now? Origami? Wrinkled shirt? Grumpled shirt? Crinkled shirt. <laughs> hey, let's talk to the PDA. I said, let's talk to the PDA. Cecily's phone. Messages. Husband. Did you get the access code? I certainly did, and I see what you did with it. What? The code you used for the encryption. It's the poem you wrote for me in college. The poem is a bit of a stretch, but I thought you'd like it. Well, you do have your moments. 
Happy birthday! It's hard to believe it's been so long already. Note, Sabrina in lowercase capital S. Merry Christmas! I wish you could be here with us. I know we'll never see this, but I just wanted to tell you that we love you and we miss, miss you dearly. Our work is going well. We started a project recently that I really think is something special. His name is Rumu. I think you would like him. Oh. Sabrina, in all caps. Sabrina, could you be here dear and translate the SESA4 prototype data to my console on the lab? I would do that right away, Cecily. Do you wish to make an archive copy? Please and thank you. Hard. Oh, contact. David Kennedy. Sabrina. Sabrina. Abigail Booth. Mother. Emily Booth. Mother. Evelyn Beer. Alan Ferris. Tina Goodson. Daniel Rihanna. Daniel Madden. Tyler Madden. Angus Matthew. Denny Mac. Access code. Green. Access code green. Unique data that can be broadcast wirelessly to unlock objects with the corresponding security codes. Show hide code. Dear Miss Booth, I have written a small code snippet that I think will be of interest to you. I'd appreciate it very much if you would look over it for me. Public class for Cecily. Variable roses equals color of red. Variable violets equal color of you. Void sweet check. If sugar dot is sweet, you dot is sweet equals true. David Kent. Roses are red, violets are blue. If sugar is sweet, then you are too. <laughs> well, that's um, cute. And I have downloaded the access codes for green, so now I can access green things. I love obedience. I love Sabrina. I am incapable of excuses. <laughs> and of listening to me, okay. apparently. I... do not blame you, Rumu. We are more than appliances. We were designed to be curious. I am also unfamiliar with this room. I have not visited often. I thought it was not my place to do so. This room is Sabrina's room. This room is not Sabrina's room. This is Sabrina's room. And also, it is not. It is. Investigate Sabrina's room. Merchant. I shall continue to call you Steve. You use an you use an Apple product to watch this stream, don't you? guys have done the soundtrack for, aren't they? Secret 
gone. It made her think that it was curious how much nicer a person looked when he smiled. She had not thought it before. Francis Hogson Barnett, The Secret Garden. Sabrina and Lucky, my oldest friend. New York, something, something. See America. And Lucky. Nibbler tank. Empty. Well, Nibbler's tank. Empty. 6,410 days. Treasure Island. Many is the long night I've dreamed of cheese. Toasted, mostly. Ruben Lawrence Stevenson, Treasure Island. The character of Robinson Crusoe was actually named after a brand of, um, of bed stores. Seriously, there was a Robinson Crusoe store somewhere. Travel poster, Paris. Travel poster, Santiago. Gale's tank. Unoccupied. These are 1,410 days. And there was something under the bed. change the night. Let me think. Was I the same when I got up this morning? There was Carol, Alice in Wonderland. I need to get a copy of Alice in Wonderland. Ooh. Crayon Blue Bird. Origin Unknown. Artist Unknown. Crayon Birds. Origin Unknown. Artist Unknown. I'm guessing the artist is, um, Sabrina. I love my home. Are you there, Bruno? She loved to hide, to be alone, and to explore. At first, she hid from her anodyne robots, and then she hid in the hope David and Cecily would come looking. They loved her. You must understand that. They cared for her with a little automated assistance. They were never cruel. Simply... Distracted. Incompatible. of the stream is um, failing on me. you are. This is not the library. No, it's not. Old version lighting control software. I believe I have access to. There we are. Let's go in this room. Sabrina's moving boxes. Sabrina's moving boxes. What? <coughs> Sabrina's moving boxes. 
search. Dad, and I hate the clutter, so I packed up all the things I can't take with me overseas and moved them down here with the rest of the things you don't have time for anymore. Seems like a fitting resting place. Good luck with your new fridge, robot, or whatever. More moving boxes. Um, a pair of boxes. Remo? Sabrina? <laughs> David and Cecily are mountain biking today without their mountain bikes. I... Do not be absurd. Those are... obsolete, Rumu. David and Cecily have upgraded to much more advanced bicycling systems. Would you expect them to use anything but the latest technology? Yes. Sabrina, age 10, goes biking. David and Sabrina, age 3, go biking. There I was an agreement. Practice time would cover two hours per day, non-consecutive, non-contemporaneous with lab work. The agreement was broken. The drums were moved to the basement. Humans are not appliances, Rumu. They are not engineered. They cannot be designed to meet specifications. They are born, and they must grow. If they do not function as intended, if they disappoint or anger us, if they ignore or neglect or disobey us, then... Pause. Then we must act in accordance with our emotional programming. Okay. Sorry if I'm mumbling again. I'm... Oh. That this makes one of us. I love Quickly now, patients. the library. David and Cecily say Sabrina can always be found in the library. to convince her later when there was even less i tried to make contact it took me months to even trace her she was a ghost a deactivated email account an old profile picture and if i found her what then what would i tell her despite everything we were strangers she would not want to hear it from me not want to hear it i love sabrina I love Sabrina, and I want her to tell the truth. Happy? Happy? She was never happy here. 
She was... lonely. I fear I may have... overloaded my emotion state manager, Rumu. I may go to standby and... defragment. Yes, they will be home soon. David enjoys the risk of injury while mountain biking, but upon sustaining even a minor one, he tends to lose interest. Take as long as you like, Rumu. You should not waste the day. I love Sabrina. I love, I love Sabrina. And Sabrina would have... I... I love you too. It's weird how she keeps getting confused between Sabrina and Sabrina. Read. Visit Paris. A local guide to Paris. The perfect place to escape your problems. Sabrina's Oh, She has a map of all the places she wants to go. That's cute. A fine magazine by Dr. Cecily Booth. I actually had a classmate called Booth. Which really nice. The Diamond Pick. Which path do you intend to take me, Neil? said the constable, sounding very interested. Conformity or rebellion? Lucky. A turn of a dog. I love Sabrina's sense of adventure. Alice in Wonderland. I wonder if I've been changed the night. Same book as elsewhere. There's more plants than people. Is it India? Travel post. India. That vent is locked, which annoys the heck out of me because I must know everything. Anodyne Computing. Error code 5567A. Local data paths damaged. Your files are surf. <laughs> Unicode error. I misspelled mountain. There we go. Recover data. Subject. No subject. If I say it this way, through a computer, will you finally listen to me? Next school break is in June, and I'm not coming home to visit. In fact, I'm not coming home any, any time in the foreseeable future. You guys can come and visit me if you want. You can write me, and I'll write back. But I can't spend another day in this house. It's my own fault. Every time I get excited to see you, every time I get here, 
I'm told that you're close to a breakthrough. So you end up locked away in the lab, and I end up hiding in the basement or the attic where your appliances can't get me. My first memories here are of making friends with the baby monitor and playing hide and seek with the vacuum cleaner. And it's only getting worse. Look, I love you guys, and I'm proud of your work, but I can't share you with any more machines. You need time to finish your big air project, and I need time alone to find myself, so let's just do that. Love, S. Emergency safety protocol active. Successfully to be secured immediately. David, what is your location? Did you think that would be better? Thank you. Yes. We were looking forward to meeting you. Also, you will be disappointed. I mean, his affection levels will be a small drop. Yes. I will take care of everything. I hope Cecily recovers soon. Yes, David. Goodbye. Oh, yes. Day 4 reactivation sequence complete. Hello, Rumu. David and Cecily are safe. David and Cecily are absent. They're safe here. Careful. Your algorithms are not fully equipped to handle anxiety. Yes, they are safe. No, they are not here. There has been a minor accident. David was at work in the laboratory when... No. No. They went out to eat. Cecily's favorite restaurant. A small fire in the kitchen. They could not get out, and the smoke. They could not get out. I love Cecily and want her to be okay. I love Sabrina and want her to be okay. She... I am fine, Rumi. Save your concern for Cecily. In any case, a narrow escape. For which we are thankful. They are both spending the night in town, and effective home management has never been more vital. To David's office, Rumu. We have work to do. Interesting hypothesis. Um, but for me, it's more a case of she keeps slipping up and cool and getting confused. Like, every time you mention Sabrina, it takes her a second or two to pick up on the context in which you're referring it to. Which is kind of more interesting. Mr. Law, displaying most recent entries. 2000XX37, Nick, Jesse Palmer, Rosa, Ada Lloyd, Lamar Boyd, Sabrina,
hearing the audio separately from what I can see. Apologize for my confusion, as does David for their absence. We hoped you would get to meet today. I love absences. I love excuses. I love Why would I invent a story like this? It would cause distress. I love how the electricity supply resets every day, so I have to turn off the death fields. Oh, dear. And David is usually so tidy. A sudden gust of wind, perhaps. I will have to monitor my climate control systems more carefully. I will have to monitor Sabrina more carefully. Oh, I love wind. Oh, yes. And how much do you expect to see from an inch off the floor? Oh, she can be sarcastic, too. I mean, she's no GLaDOS, but... B. Fatherhood for dummies. How can dad for fathers who have no concept of human affection? Volume 1 to 3. Um. Marriage for dummies. How to be less awful. A love in 10 easy steps. Cecily and David, wedding day. Cecily and David. David and David. Oh, I have collected some more regard. <laughs> David Zen Garden. Feel Zen. <laughs> and a bunch of degrees. Master's degree, Cambridge. Graduate elementary school, Sabrina. Computer science, Cecily. National Medal of Innovation, Cecily. Master's degree, Cambridge, David. Computing at MIT, David. Master's degree, Cambridge, David. Now, if you please. David would like these papers destroyed. I love to clean, but I love David's papers. I like his papers. You love David. David hates paper. Obsolete technology, he says. These are just old specs, Rumu. Old iterations of a design long since... Well, they are no longer required. Sit down and watch the original play. 
subject of determination of power services. Dear Mr. Kennedy, we are contacting you in order to notify you that due to outstanding fees, Anodyne Energy will be terminating all power services to your current address. This termination will occur on April 30th, unless the outstanding accounts are balanced. If you have any further inquiries, please contact us. Security. I am not a robot. <laughs> of course that works. Why wouldn't that work? That's just <laughs> no security check. Just a uh, oh, tick this box. Oh, you're human. <laughs> Project Sabrina 2.0. Promotional stabilization patch 3.1. 3.4.1 Application is malfunctioning emotion state devices. User David authorized. Code base missing. Please insert code backup. Patch command status incomplete. Generate patch unavailable. SESA. Project SESA Simple Emotion State Compliance. Project Listing for Applies Personalities and Related Emotions. Anchor. Too much COD. Terrorism and megalomania parameter set to high. Functionally fine in mode. Fear. Functions enhanced and refined by addition to emotion states. A minor success. Oh, it's scared of me. That's good. What? It, 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 it's scared of us. Oh, it works better. This is a good thing. <laughs> Disgust. In much respect, a horrible idea. Put out of its misery. It was supposed to be funny at the time. Oh, it's a. It's the toilet. They gave the toilet a sense of disgust. They put it out of its misery because it's shit. Sadness. Major C is unstable. <laughs> oh dear, and David is usually so tidy. Love, in progress, looking good, my favorite one so far. Oh. Uh, okay. So it took me a while to figure out what that locker thing said. Will you be sleeping in the office? Cecily had an accident. Processing. I have to take more of an accident. I informed Cecily. Will you be sleeping in the office? Relationship status updated. I hope you two are happy together. Behold the Anodyne Paper Annihilator! Look on my blade! Ye documents and despair! I love you. Anodyne Paper Annihilator does not recognize God. None may get close to the Anodyne Paper Annihilator. Thank you, Lula. One last thing for David to worry about. And Cecily, of course. Once she recovers. Wait, Rumu. My atmospheric sensors are detecting airborne contaminant at 20 parts per billion. Stand by for quarantine lockdown. 
find the tunnel. If you spell it right. Note to self, buy another with laundry hamper. Sess's tinkering has left the other one unusable, at least without an emotional driver patch. Until then, I'll have to keep my washing in here. Sorry, locker. Oh, I see. How embarrassing. David would never normally leave clothes dirty. You may deposit them in the guest bedroom laundry hamper. Look, I don't know why I'm getting quieter and quieter. Oh shit, that's why. I didn't plug the headphones back in properly. God damn it. Just that closer to my my mouth. Oh. There? You should be able to hear me now. Quite compared to the background music anyway, um... Uh, there. I just added 10 decibels worth of gain to my input, you should be able to hear me better now. Uh, tell me if that's still an issue. I love dirty laundry. I love uh, <laughs> appropriate human idioms. I'm gonna go with the appropriate human idioms one just because that seems funnier. Aha. Uh -huh. Very amusing. Remind me to lower the sophistication level on your humor filter. Put dirty clothes in laundry hamper. Okay. Where's the laundry hamper? Must be in the guest's bedroom. Ah, I see. I'm... What is it? Oh, security gate. <laughs> okay, we have like these security gates around. Like, oh, we need to keep the the Roomba out of the room. Let's put something. Let's put something at like its wheel height to trip it up, just so it doesn't try to. Guest bedroom. More paper. More paper. Sabrina, experiment files. Note. Dave, it's critical that we apply 2.0 when Sabrina is calm and content. Lest she become locked in the torment permanently. Perhaps after morning tea? Cecily. Entry 1. What it to be no dev notes? The subject is increasingly hostile. She frequently lashes out over menial tasks. Patch 1.2 attempting to resolve through minor bug fixing in her emotional matrices. Entry 2. What it to be no dev notes? Sabrina did not respond well to Patch 1.2. The dev found her sobbing hysterically in the server room. Why did we do this? Why did we create her to feel so much pain? This is cruel, plain and simple. David was right. We can't live like this. She can't live like this. What it Sabrina dev notes? Critical failure. We've had to move all the Sabrina patch code out of the house server. Subject keeps accessing the logs and rewriting her own code, undoing our work. I'm afraid of her. Moving all copies of the Sabrina patch to the PC in my study under maximum security. David. Entry 4. What it Sabrina dev notes? Patch 1.6 and 1.7 were critical failures. Subject is in... Immense pain. 
Commencing work on subject uh, Sabrina Patch 2.0, focusing for emotional restriction. Sabrina simply cannot handle constantly evolving human emotional spectrums. Patch 2.0 will stabilize and knock her into a single emotional spectrum, David. Life, the universe, and everything. Now I lay me down to sleep, try to count electric sheep, street dream wishes you can keep, how I hate the night. Marvin, the paranoid android, everyone. Douglas Adams, life, the universe, and everything. Good book there. Cecily's Diary, Entry 1. Dear Diary, Sabrina threw another horrible tantrum today. This is the th this time about wanting a cat. I had to explain logically. I tried to explain logically to her that we can't risk having another animal loose in the house and dropping her work. She won't listen. Plus, I'm allergic. I feel like I can't do anything right with her. Dear I diary, I drove into town and bought the damn cat today. David protested, but maybe if Sabrina sees that I'm willing to compromise, she'll come home. It's empty here without her. Maybe the cat will keep us company. Dear diary. David still doesn't approve of Ada, and I've caught him snapping pictures of her on his phone more than once. I think he's quite fond of the Countess. It's nice to see him smiling again. Dear Diary, my allergies are more manageable now. It seems the longer I spend with Ada, the more accustomed my immune system becomes. We're even getting along. Funny motherhood with us, easy. Patch backup. Take. Sabrina Patch 2.0 Codebase. Here's the backup codebase for the Sabrina 2.0 Emotional Stabilization Patch. So no more state here, we'll need to recompile it again on my, on my computer if we want to actually apply it to anything. Silent in very fast. Love is the Turing test. It's how we check for life. We ask and we answer. We seek a human response. Catherine Villa. Silently and very fast. <laughs> David, Sabrina, and Cecily. Laundry hamper. Item needed. Talk. Hello, hamper. I am delighted to accept. I am ecstatic. I am overjoyed to accept your laundry. I am depressed. Amber, I love you. I am cheered up slightly. I love Hamper. Will help Hamper. Oh. I am cautiously optimistic to accept your laundry. I hope it works this time, but I am not expecting anything. And there's a screwdriver there. That is... I... I don't know what to say to that. You almost can't hear me. Oh, for fuck's sake. Modifying audio I have doubled my audio input to... I've doubled the audio input, theoretically. And for some reason, that caps it at minus uh, plus six decibels. Now, for shit's sake, this better work. 
Damn it. Um, <clears throat> project hamper diagnostic. Project SCSA single emotion state appliance laundry hamper emotional diagnostics. Emotional metric status unstable. No, really. Dev notes one. Developer notes SCSA -E a prototype 115B is progressing slowly. The name Single Emotion State seems to be growing into more and more of a misnomer with each passing day. Genuine emulation of an emotion requires not a single parameter but a spectrum. Happiness is not really joy, it's also relief, satisfaction, contentment. Each facet is a reflection of another emotion. Could relief exist without worry? Fulfillment without desire? Limiting the matrix to only one given parameter produces but a hollow simulacrum of two emotion. I must go deeper. Dev notes too. Developer notes. Balancing the emotional matrix is to favor opening happiness. Hello. 